pretty fresh because you know today i'm going to be showing you guys what i got from ulta and sephora in the past past actual like month and a half two months i got like a bunch of brand new stuff just in my makeup desk that i haven't even touched i haven't recorded in a long time but it's 2022 if you don't know my birthday just passed my birthday was january 18th i turned 20 five years old yeah you know like it's young og status i don't even know where to start i got so much stuff i don't even know where to start i'm gonna start off with these brushes i got these brushes on sale as you can see and they are the real technique the electric love bad um bad blush brush and i also got this upset complexion limited edition electric love cool i got these two brushes and i really like the way they looked more than anything like those are too cute but these these are the only one they had i'm sure they had a collection of them but these are the only two that i got so i got some lashes i got some by salon perfect the wing demi collection got those and I also got the Ardell Faux Mink Lashes because I love to have like just some regular lashes on hand. Also with that, I got this from CVS. I didn't get this from <laughs> Ulta or Sephora. I got this from CVS and it is the Kiss Lash Glue Adhesive Liner. I really like this. Like this is the only way that I really like successfully can put on a lash. I know I'm going in such a random order, but I don't know. This is just how I got it. I didn't really set up or anything. I have so much new stuff. It's like, I can't even. And also, I got the Photo Finish Primerized Smashbox Hydrating Primer, and it's part of their new collection. I actually went into Ulta a few days ago, and they was having a relaunch sale. Then it makes my face feel smooth and even and it also doesn't feel too sticky but it holds. If I want to review on any of these items that I'm mentioning let me know and I'll do a review for you guys. I'm high as hell man. I got two more palettes. They're like when I say I've been looking, I've been looking, I've been looking on Amazon. Like something kept on holding me back from buying those liner palettes. You know, like the neon liner. What I got is the Creator Revolution Hydra Pigment. It's a pigment palette and they come in these two variations. And basically you are supposed to use water to activate these and when i say bomb matter of fact i'm actually using this color right here that's how i got that liner up top that green color and when i say bomb y'all because i've been looking on amazon and amazon had them but they was like 50 dollars and yeah i was like no i got these at also for 15 dollars like 15 dollars i got it. both of them needed this in my life and I'm pretty sure like if you really like doing makeup and you want to start doing all those creative liner designs and I use this brush right here, just a thin liner brush and dip it in some water and you're good to go. You can draw whatever you want to with these. That's the, that's the beauty in this. I'm so glad I got this. I got these two palettes from Juvia's Place and this one is the Rebel Army. And this one here is the Rebel Gray. So this is basically uh, the Rebels collating. Ooh, I love that. I love that. That's like, it has like blue gray tones in it. And those shimmers, honey, let me show you. What? Look at, honey, let me finish that. Look at that. That is too pretty. So yeah so i got this palette and i also got this juvia's place the army and this is what i use on my eyes today it's giving very you know very snakish very gardenish very you know it's giving it's giving what it was supposed to give so yeah 
it looks like on the inside and I love this green. I love, if you, if you know me, you know I love swatching shimmer shades. I love shimmers. Anything that's, look. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's it. So I got these four ColourPop liquid liners. These are the colors that I got. And the red one, this one is oops, in the shade, shade Try Me. Um, this one is Grande. It's kind of like a brown shade liner. And this one is the Heels Green. And I also got Ducky, which is the pink liner. And I wanted to try some different liners because I came with the um the NYX liners. They dry up too fast and you really be having like cracky liners. So I couldn't. So I like that I got is the Morphe Ashley Smart Alignment Cake Liner Palette. I should have got the whole collection, but I didn't want the whole collection. So basically you dip a small brush in water and you swipe off in here and you create a liner however you want and you can do more than just liner with this actually if you want to just use this as your like cut crease i think that'll work too also i went and got another got this black radiance finishing powder in the color golden almond finish and this is my second one i've really been liking this to like set my foundation down and yeah this is like it's like one of my faves as you can see look i'm using the heck out of this one i've hit pen like this one has been through some things so if you guys want a favorites video let me know down below because i can do a favorites video i do have a few faves that i always use and i it ain't no switching up because like when you know you know like when you know that you need to be looking a certain type of way and you don't want to risk it yeah if y'all like that let me know. also got these elf camo camo concealers these are the concealers that i got in I basically got like a shades to like ombre, kind of do like an ombre effect on my face so that it blends better. I love to always have a brighter shade because I like to look real bold in a skin tone shade and just something that's more bronzier than my skin tone. And I've really been liking these. Another thing that I got is this e.l.f. Jelly Pop Glow Stick. It's basically so you can get that like water fresh look just a fresh subtle like glow to your face face to your skin it's more like a skincare another thing i got is this nyx wonder stick in the color deep and i love these i've already used these before so i pretty much know how they work actually ran out so i had to go get another one my contour definitely love these for my contour when I'm and it's not as harsh as you know normal contours are like really deep it's more so subtle and it blends out really well because it's creamy their new product that's new to me is I've been wanting to get makeup removing balms I heard they were better to remove your makeup and the one that I got is the Neutrogena makeup removing melting balm so far so good i've been using it and it's kind of like it's kind of like a oil like it's kind of oil based so technically it's like putting vaseline on your face if you ask me another thing that i got is the cat mind d 24 hour super brown pomade gel it looks like this and i got it in the color arbigine arbigine i guess Arbigine. This is for like when I like to wear my hair in a, more of a red color then, or a burgundy type color so my brows can match. You know. right. It looks like this. Cat Von D True Portrait Liquid to Powder 
foundation and it is in the color medium and let me take it out of here that's what it looks like i caught it on sale i think i got this for like nine dollars so i caught this at sephora if you want a review on it just let me know yeah i i got some i got some things to say about this but I definitely would buy it again. Like, best thing that I got, but certainly not least, is the Benefit, Benefit Highbrow. And it's basically used just to, you know, define your brows, make your brows look more lifted. You can put it underneath your brow and kind of like blend it out. Yeah. Okay, you guys, that concludes this video. And that concludes most of the stuff that I got that's brand new for the past month and a half, two months. Basically, I'm going to be using these products to see how they work. And I'm going to be trying to do different looks on my channel for you guys using the products. But if you want a review on any products that I listed, let me know. And I'll do a specific review for that product so you can know. Go out and buy it or if you've seen it and you was deciding whether you should buy it or not. Yeah, I'll let you know. Without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. My name is Pretty French. I'm going for whatever you want to call me, girly. You can call me whatever, girly. And I'll, yeah. But the wig that I'm wearing is a wig that I made. It really needs some curls in it, girl. But I didn't feel like curling it. So, the hair came from somebody off of Amazon. I'm not really sure, but you don't know. I'll look it up and I'll make sure I link them down in the description box. Or just, just, just let me know if you want to know, honey. But yeah, I'm hungry, y'all. I'm gonna go get me something to eat. It's about that time to go and, and eat. <laughs>